Hey everybody, this is Eric with The Dramatic and a Friday bonus video. Um, typically my plan is going to try to be to put um, shout outs and such, a, a normal bonus, a regular bonus video, shout outs and such. However, we've done like three or so of them in a row. Um, but we, so we interrupted the normal, <laughs> the normal shout outs and such for this uh, special unboxing. Um, we've kind of teased it through the social medias. And um, so here's what's going on, everybody. There's a new drum set in the drum attic. What is it, you may ask? <laughs> Pretty excited about this, and there's a neat story behind it as well. Let me get this box up here. There we go. Can you see that there? This is the, uh, the Mapex Saturn Evolution. I'm excited to see this color. Um, as I as I open this box, and we're not going to open everything. We're just going to open this one box, and um, and then because uh, I don't want this video to be an hour long. But while I open this, the dogs are gonna... my dogs are fighting, and uh, I did want to just kind of tell you uh, the story here, and that's this. The um, Loretta and I had been looking at drum kits and I had been kind of checking out the, um, I was kind of going back and forth between the Tama Star Classics and the, um, the Mapex Saturn Evolutions. And, uh, and had, had talked with some, some friends about uh, their experience with both of those different drums and did some research. Ultimately landed on the uh, Saturn, or the Mapex Saturn Evolution. And, um, <clears throat> Here's the cool thing. Um, we were in the process of budgeting it out, figuring it out. Got a call uh, from a friend and they said, uh, hey, we love what, what you guys are doing. Um, it's a real blessing to, to us and uh, we wanna buy you a new drum set. Crazy, like, I, like it chokes me up, it's amazing. Anyway, so amazing story. Um, we feel super blessed, and um, I, I, I know maybe I say that word too much, but I don't know what else to call it. Um, anyway, so um, here are our Tom mounts. Sit those over here. All right, let's see if we can get this. Uh, I need to get Loretta over here to help me. Oh, I might have it. All right. So the configuration that we ordered. So let me sit this here and I'll put the, this box down. Actually, let me just get this one out to you. So the configuration that we ordered um, was a 22-inch uh, kick, uh, 10, 12, 14, 16-inch toms. And, um, and then we uh, were also able to order some uh, black plated Mapex hardware, uh, which we're gonna open one of those stands uh, for you too. If we, uh, if it, you know, if we're not running too long. So let's get this uh, bad boy out of here. And uh, let's see what's, uh, see what's going on. All right. I'm excited. I'm super excited. So, um, the, um, well, I'll pull it out and we'll, we'll show you. Toss that there. Let's, uh, get the plastic off. So this is uh, the Mapex Saturn Evolution Walnut Birch Shells in a Tuscan Red with the black uh, brushed um, lugs and uh, rims. Um, and it's got the little dial in to kind of kill some of the ring in there, but can you see that pretty, pretty well, Loretta? 
So that's the that's the 10 inch tom. It's got a Remo, Remo Ambassador coated on the top and um, Ambassador Clear on the Rezzo side, um, right from the, the factory. Look at that over there. Oh, I had to, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's, um, when we were looking at, once we had decided on the Mapex, we were looking at, um, we were looking at uh, a gunmetal in the, with the black brushed. Um, then we came across this Tuscan Red and we were like, reminded us of Superman and I love it. Um, I've never had a kit this color. Um, this is the 12 inch Tom I'm pulling out. Um, and quite honestly, it reminded me of dad. So, and Loretta of dad too, not just, actually it was Loretta that brought up <laughs> that it made her think of Superman. And um, we liked it and then she said that and then I was like 100% sold, <laughs> sold on it. Um, so here's the only bummer of course, it has to ship in several packages, right? So somehow, the kick drum shipped later. Well, actually, it all left Sweetwater at the same time. Also, P.S., shout out to Joe at uh, Sweetwater. He's an amazing guy, wonderful sales rep. Helped us with the, you know, with the process here. And um, anyway, appreciate you, Joe. And... <clears throat> um, but anyway, so everything left Sweetwater the day it was ordered, and then, well, that's wrapped around differently. And anyway, and then, um, but the, but the kick drum left the FedEx facility at a different time than, um, than the rest of the kit. So there's the, there's the 12. These have the Sonic Clear bearing edge, and they've got this. Mapex is new and uh, uh, patented mounting system, keeping the drum free floating. Again, same heads on this. But we'll get a close up of that color and that badging. Beautiful. So excited for the, the tracking says the bass drum will be here. When was it? Monday. Monday. <laughs> so it, it could show up today. It's possible that it could show up today. It's just a, a town over. So. At any rate, so this is the Saturn, or the Mapex Saturn Evolution and the Tuscan Red with the black brushed hardware. Oh, it's just, it's so beautiful. We'll get some B-roll uh, for you. And, uh, all right, so let me, let's show you this, uh, see what this hardware looks like. If I'm honest with you, I already opened one of the boxes of the hardware because I wanted to see what it looked like. But I'm gonna show you how it's packaged. Uh, okay, hold on, I'm off. I'm off, out of frame. Okay. Because the last time when I bought my Tama Superstar Classics, I bought stands, they were all just loose on the sales floor. So, but I thought the, the black plated hardware would look super snazzy. Um, um, with the snazzy, I just dated myself big time. I thought it would look really nice um, with this black brushed metal on, on here. So I've got five stands. I'm just gonna pull one of these out. I hope you can still see that. My camera person left me to my own devices. Um, let's see here. So we got packaged in this nice box. Here, a little caring for your hard work is the black plated. If you bang it around on other metal, it'll it'll lose its uh, it'll chip. Um, that you know, do a lot of moving the kit around. It stays pretty much just in the drum attic. Um, so let's take a look. Yeah, that's really pretty, isn't it? And it's got the the locking system here for the symbol, which is similar to uh, excuse me to my to the the locks I have on the Tama stands. 
Um, but anyway, so they've got it broken down into three the three sections. Um, but it's a, they're double brace. Let me move these. So they're the double brace heavy duty stands. Um, they look nice. They're heavy. They, they're well made. Um, this is my first experience uh, with Mapex hardware and with a Mapex drum kit. Um, my little 10 inch side snare is a Mapex. Um, however, it is a, uh, it's, 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 it's just a 10 inch Mapex steel snare drum. But having an experience with the snare is very different than with the, uh, with the actual, with an actual drum kit. So anyway, so I am really, really excited. Um, hopefully I don't have to wait till Monday to get uh, the kick drum. Hopefully it comes later today. Okay, so we've got everything set up. Everything feels comfortable. Um, the only thing I have done is just, there was a loose uh, lug on the floor tom, on the bottom, on the reso side, so I tightened it up just, just past finger tight. Everything else other than the kick drum is, that's exactly how it came shipped. Uh, Mapex to Sweetwater, Sweetwater to me, and, um, on the kick drum, the reso head is just a little past finger tight and the batter head is just slightly past um, that. And then I just have a uh, Evans EQ pad in the kick drum. So that's all that I've got. So we're gonna play these um, wide open as they are. And then we're gonna put some moon gels on the tops and kind of listen to them uh, those different ways. Just kind of get an idea of how it sounds. And then from there, um, for the next drum curl and I'm dialing things in a little tighter, but let's just get an idea of how this sounds for all intents and purposes out of the box. Okay, so I decided that after five years I'm going to buy some new moon gels, so that's going to be a purchase. Uh, we've got one on the 10, one on the 12, one on the 14, two on the 16. Let's see how that sounds. Alright everybody, thank you so much for tuning in for our special unboxing of this new drum set. Um, thank you to our friend who uh, who blessed us with this. Um, I, I don't have words, um, but I am deeply grateful and appreciative. Um, humbled, <laughs> humbled by it. Um, so again, those were just out of the box sounds. Um, didn't do any fine tuning on anything. That was with and without moon gels. So that's just how they sound out of the, right out of the box. I'm so impressed. I'm really happy with how they sound. Um, as I kind of start noodling for the next drum cover, I will play with, there is a dial on the, on the rack toms over here that'll allow you to, to um, 
to kind of muffle some of the resonance or let it be open. Um, so I'll, I'll kind of start playing with that. Um, I think I liked the high toms better open without the moon shells. Thought the lower toms sounded good with the moon shells. So we'll just kind of experiment. Might toss some um, some other muffling in the kick drum, see what happens. But I think it's got everything's got a lot of punch, a lot of attack, um, and just a beautiful tone. And it and it looks uh, absolutely gorgeous. Um, wonderful experience with Sweetwater. Um, FedEx was a little frustrating, <laughs> which isn't Sweetwater's fault. Um, FedEx said Friday the 25th, woo, um, nothing came Friday. Then they changed the date to Saturday or to Monday, sorry, Monday. And I was like, what? Then everything but the kick drum arrived Saturday and the kick drum said it was coming Sunday. So I guess FedEx didn't have room on the one van, so they put it on the other van. And, um, and they said, our dates are day dependable. So, um, Apparently what that means is unless we can't get it there, then we'll change the date, um, which is what happened. And it came Monday morning. So I was finally able to get it all put together yesterday morning, uh, kind of get it all pieced together. Anyways, it was just kind of, um, I am impatient. Um, I was so excited. It's like, I'm, I'm like a little boy, like on Christmas morning, you know, a little kid on Christmas morning. And uh, at any rate, um, I, I love them. Um, all right, just a little bit that I've played. Um, I'm a huge, huge fan. Um, and again, um, I looked at, um, I looked a little bit at SJC, listened to some samples from them. Um, I, I um, talked to, um, or I requested a quote from another company um, and then told them not to worry about it because I, I didn't want an all maple kit. I wanted to go something different. Um, and these are, of course, the Walnut Birch uh, blend shells, and they just sound fantastic. Uh, but I, you know, look at the Tama Star Classics. I even looked to see what Yamaha and Pearl had out there and um, ultimately landed here at the Mapex Saturn Evolution. Uh, and I absolutely love them. They look fantastic, and the black hardware uh, looks phenomenal. Um, but Sweetwater had them out the door the day the, day, um, the order was placed. So... That's uh, super cool, and I've already done it at the beginning of this video, but another shout out to Joe Secu at uh, SECU, I hope I said that right, Joe, um, at Sweetwater Sound. Fantastic guy, very, very helpful. Appreciate all your help. Um, anyway, guys, I think that's all I've got to say today. We will see you next time.